Good day learners and welcome to today's video where I'm going to be quickly looking at a question that I found in one of the exam papers on HTML and was asking us to insert an image from the images folder and um, they wanted us to, and this was the important but to reference the image in its primary location. Don't move the image. Right. So when we look at this, we can see here we've got our website and we've got our images. Okay. So when I open the website, this is what I end up seeing and the image is missing over there. Okay. So you can do this one of a few ways. Let's just look at a simple way to do this. So we want to get this image Amazon into that particular cell over there, but they don't want us because usually what we would do is we would copy that and we would paste it over in here. Now they don't want us to do that. That's why they said they want us to reference the root. Well, let's look at the coding first for this. And let's see if we can spot anything here. So I'm going to go through and I'm looking at the table. Here's my table. And what do I see there? Here's, for example, Mark Zuckerberg. And have a look at that. The tag doesn't change. We've got IMG source equals. And we've got a width and a height that's set there. But look at this. Usually it would just be the name of the particular picture. But can you see here? It's referencing images which is the folder over there, and then a forward slash, and then the name of the particular image. So if you are required to do that, um, this is what you will then do. You'll reference it like that. So what I'm going to do to make my life easier is I'm going to copy this one, and I'm going to go into this particular cell, and let's have a look here. Um, it should be this one over here. And I'm going to Paste that in there. Okay. The reason I'm going to do that, I first want to see if it works. So file, save, refresh, boom, that works. Now, the only thing I have to do is make sure the name of my image is correct. And I'm going to go in here again. We're still referencing the images folder. And now I'm going to change Facebook to Amazon.jpg. Is that correct? Spell correctly. Yes. File, save, refresh and done. And that's how easy it is to do this. But just remember, if you are referencing from a root folder, then you just have to put the name of the folder first, forward slash, and then the full name of the file as you usually would. 